Auto throttle off. Throttle is on. Set thrust. Thrust set. Instruments are checked. Clamp. 80 knots. Checked. Rotate. Oh, gear up. Select. Oh, select cloud trust. Climb trust selected. You know, climb selected. FMS EPR here. 1000. Stabilized. Skydiving 1045, contact ground 1107. Hello. 1107, hello. Yeah, autopilot off. Skydiving 009, allow me 19 right, clear to land. Clear to land 19 right, can I land 009? Clear to land. Stabilized. Thank you. Navy 109 in contact Stockholm. Hello. 109 is bye bye. Looking good. Thank you. Ask an event 2679. Name the 2679 and the left wind around with 08 to get the takeoff. Take off 08, can I run 2679? 50. 40. 30. 20. 10. So now we can see that aircraft, uh, the Austrian that just took off, it's at 1100 feet, 1200 feet now, and it's climbing. So when he's up at about just below 2000, we usually get our takeoff clears. Then we have the uh, required separation. So I'm spooling up the engines here. Turning on the radar. Right. Austrian 318, go contact uh, departure 124.1. Departure 124.1, good day, Austrian 318, go. Scandinavian 573, runway 01 left, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 01 left, Scandinavian 573. So there, set trust. Trust is set. 83.6. Right. 8 knots. Checked. V1. Rotate. Before we used to have, uh, be able to have uh, passengers coming up onto the flight deck, for instance, kids, and um, uh, I used to have this hanging in the cockpit actually. So then uh, when we flew into, for instance, the Canary Islands on their vacation during the winter, I had them point out approximately where they thought on the globe that we were. That was a lot of fun. And then when we flew the intercontinental routes, it was kind of fun to also uh, uh, draw the actual route onto the globe. And then we were able to show uh, why the route on the on the flat map 
looks like it's a curve. And uh, here they could see the actual uh, situation that we were flying along a straight line over the globe, but that looks as a curve when you look at it on a uh, flat map. So this was the route from Stockholm to New York that we have, Scandinavian 903. And then for Copenhagen, we used to fly to Seattle and uh, Chicago as well. And then uh, going east, we flew uh, to uh, Tokyo, to uh, Beijing, Bangkok, and also New Delhi. And uh, most of them had uh, been uh, uh, into turbulence. And then I gave them explanation that the turbulence was caused by the fact that we were flying over these bridges here, which uh, some of them actually bought. <laughs> <laughs> but it was, uh, it was a lot of fun when we were able to have passengers coming into the flight deck. A lot of people are uh, afraid of flying, and uh, when they get to see how it actually works, they get to see the pilots. Uh, in most cases, that helps uh, when they are afraid of flying. So that's a little sad that they're not uh, allowed to do that anymore. So that was my global positioning system version 1.0. <laughs> Fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, ten. Speed break up. Order pilot disconnect. Check. The Scandinavian, Scandinavian design, specially made for SIS. The coffee pot, easy to pour, S save your wrists when pouring coffee, and that's what we do a lot. Expecting a uh, Trosa 2 Juliet uh, for uh, runway 01 left, Arlanda. And this uh, Trosa 2 Juliet uh, is a so-called uh, CDA approach or continuous descent approach, or as we like to call it, uh, a green approach, uh, because uh, they are much uh, shorter, or at least a little shorter than the other approach, and they are also designed to uh, We've flown uh, with a constant uh, descent and the, the throttles in idle. It's in a part of uh, Sweden uh, named uh, Småland, where they're known to be very creative. The uh, furniture chain uh, IKEA comes from this area as well, which is, uh, it can be found basically anywhere in the world, I think. It's so funny, they quite often are located close to the airports. So then, uh, once in a while, for instance, at Newark, when we break out of the clouds, the first thing we see is IKEA. <laughs> so then we've been flying for eight hours, and the first thing we see of the U.S. is IKEA. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Yeah. Plus 100, 100. Sierra Charlie Runner, can I clear the approach? Now we're 3 5 in a right hand second. Minimums. Here for approach, runway 35, right hand circuit, Sierra Charlie Romeo. Fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, ten. I must have walked down from Oh, Oscar Alpha Hotel, contact Copenhagen departure 124, that's one minus 75.